evening to you. New education guidelines could have your child repeating the third grade. Uh, an effort to improve reading skills will require Hoosier students to pass a test before moving on to the fourth grade, a move that is drawing a lot of support and criticism. In a special Education Watch 10 report, Jacqueline Bieblish joins us now live in the studio with more on the changes. Jacqueline? Mark Patrice, the State Board of Education approved the plan earlier this week to give third graders a reading test. Passing it sends them on to the fourth grade, but just a few points shy, and they'll have to repeat the third grade, something causing concern for both local school officials and parents. These seats empty quickly at the sound of the bell, but they could be full one summer in the future, full of third graders who didn't pass a state-mandated reading assessment, one of the most recent plans waiting for the governor's approval. This um, law would, or proposal would enforce retention across the board so instead of selecting from many interventions it would be requiring one intervention and that would take the decision of where students go next away from those they interact with most it takes any permission or resistance out of a parent's hands. Harris worries about cases where a written test may not have all the answers. They've made more growth than what was expected of them. However, we're still going to retain them. If you didn't pass by one point, sometimes you might want to reevaluate. Dr. Goler says retention is used in Vigo County for some students who struggle, but she believes there are other alternatives that can be successful. Principal Harris says as a parent, she worries about basing everything on just one test. We know we have students who take tests better. Somebody can perform in a classroom but struggles from the pressure of a test. And one bad test could fill these empty desks during summer school. In and school officials are also looking at budget concerns such as where the money will come from for the summer school that some of these students will need before retaking the test. So you've heard about the issue. Now we want to hear from you. Take our web poll at WTHITV.com. Do you think holding students back will help improve student literacy? You can answer the question and find more about proposed education changes. We'll have the poll results for you tonight on News 10 Night Watch. You can also sound off on our Facebook page. Mark, back to you. Thank you, Jacqueline.